Hey guys. How are you doing next? Back out again with the boys. Boys, season one, episode six, called The Innocents. Uh, yes, you remember we left last off? Let's last left off. So, the chick, the she doesn't speak English. Mm -hmm. She got hurt, and she was help saving the the French guy, and she was able to recover. So some sort of she's some sort of soup that I, I don't know what her superpower is, but yeah. Um, I mean, we also lost that Starlight basically said F it, and she just basically said I will be myself in front of all you know. That whole Christian crowd. Yeah. Which I like said, know your audience. <laughs> you know? And that's but, what, yeah, that's yeah. what he said. But the rest of the world is going to love it because the rest of the world is not like that. You know, I'm hoping that she was like Yeah, but Christian. majority, talking about America in general, yeah. they may not, I don't know. I it guess it depends. I don't know. Um, and um, I could have seen, like I said, with that baby scene. And how. Uh, oh, he had the baby and yeah. he was just like going like yeah. that. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we're just diving into this because we just fresh off from that last episode and we're just going to knock this one out called The Innocent. The Innocent. All right. Okay. Let's see what this one's all about. Here we go. Heavenly Body lost her luster two weeks after Starlight's shocking appearance at the Believe Expo. Social media is still buzzing about her controversial speech. Was it a breakdown or a triumph? Of course, my thoughts are with Starlight and uh, I support her in every way. What I want to know? Who's that dude that's like his <laughs> in her face? <laughs> oh my god. Well, I thought it would go the opposite direction, but everyone's behind us. Yeah. No, they can't get rid of her. Yeah. Oh, it's going to backfire. That's me in the middle. <laughs> Love you, Mom, Dad. Welcome to my bedroom. The baseball hall of fame, you might call it. Hasn't changed a bit. Oh, there they are, the Tigers. This isn't, I mean, this is not team. his room, yeah, is it? Yeah, this isn't bullshit. Short stuff. Of course, it's going to be bullshit. Show everything to come back. Uh, I'm sorry. Why is that there? Uh, sorry? Who put the fucking blanket on the bed? Uh, Randy said that. Who's Randy said that? <laughs> Randy, why? You fucking asshole. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> <laughs> why is there a blanket there? <laughs> He's obviously sensitive about it. Oh, the blanket. He has like a mommy issue you, or something. Okay? Oh. By Vought has been it as polio vaccine. You tell me if God's not reaching up the twats of American girls and blessing babies. So can you leave God out of this? Oh, hold on, hold on. So no hero is born. None. We're all just kids dust with the blue shit. Even... Even fucking Starlight. Yeah. It's my big idea to book you for the Believe Expo. What could go wrong? <laughs> you are playing to your base. At least I don't have to kiss your ass anymore. You were kissing. You were her. never doing that. You were being. <laughs> <laughs> so she did get fired. Oh yeah. Why don't you cut the petulant diva shit, show the fucking gratitude, and let us do our job? No. Oh, boys. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, I don't mean to be ungrateful, but no red carpets, no reality TV. And no Maxima commercials. She ain't taking a BS. And I want my old uniform back. And I think we may need to reconsider your position in the seven. And I think that firing an employee after she reported sexual assault on live TV might change your status. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I hope we can count on your discretion. Sorry, I don't do discretion. <laughs> Milking this thing for all it's worth. Excuse me? This empowerment act. And every time I'm on a red carpet now, they're asking me how I'm supporting Starlight. But hey, as long as you're trending, right? When I was younger, I read your autobiography so many times that I wore it out. I had to buy a second one. I wanted to live my life exactly like yours. Because you didn't just break all the bones in your right arm stopping that school bus from falling off of a bridge. But you also went to every kid's physical therapy afterwards. Mm. Just to show the world that they were heroes too. You really stood for something. And now, pretty sure that was just written by the marketing guys. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 
you know what? I kind of feel like she wished she could be like her, you know? Because I wonder what Starlight would have done in that situation in the plane. Yeah. Because she would have gone down with the plane. Well, I still don't know her exact powers. A lot of them. She's I wish basically, they she's basically like Wonder Woman. There's this one hero who shall remain nameless, but has ice powers. Ice princess. <laughs> I'm not allowed to say. Uh, you know, being intimate when she climaxed and accidentally turned into ice. Just for a second. But I was, uh, still in there <laughs> at negative 346 degrees. Oh my god, it's Same temperature as liquid nitrogen. As you can imagine, um, it snapped off. Crazy thing is, I still miss her. No, I wouldn't be missing her. What is the cost of a mortal like me for being with a god like her? Well, did, he didn't die? Can't you bleed out from there? Well, it was frozen. This is about Starlight. Starlight? What, <laughs> what about Starlight? Everybody seems to want to know who she was referencing in that speech, and it is not going away. It's only a matter of time before she, or let's be honest, some of the other women speak yeah. up. Uh, so she knows. Yeah, so I told you, she knows. So she needs to been misunderstanding. You just, you know, handle it like, like you do. This is the way we are handling things <laughs> now. I realized that my behavior has caused Starlight a great deal of pain. And I sincerely apologize for this. Though at the time, I believed that our encounter was consensual. I now realize that, um... I misread the moment. Our new movie, Insurrection. It's really exciting. It's my first uh, movie. With what? Why are you? Bot, cinematic oh, you know he, he's a uh, BCU. He's a producer and writer of the show. Is he? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Men and women be mm. The way you brush your hand up against that Wall Street guy, brother, that shit right there, now that was ruthless. I mean, if I dropped you like a hot potato afterwards, hey, you can I think it's bullshit. But with the SEC, who the fuck out, are you? Why don't you take a peek and see? So, how do you know about Cleo? She was happy. That's why you like this past fuck. Why she was happy with me, but huh. she was happy. We still don't know about his Home ex. Homelander raped her. Oh, see. Homelander what? Homelander raped her. Oh. Sorry about the blanket. It never should have been there, and Randy Septek has already been terminated. But right now, we need to finish that tour. She's doing that manipulating again. Yeah. To show how down to earth and ready to serve you are. And I need you to tell the mother story. Please. <laughs> oh, she is touching him. Yeah, so they're not mother and father, they're mother and son. Me along, I right? know, but like. Yeah. Surprised she's letting him touch her. Yeah. Scared of shit if I was him. <laughs> yeah, well, she's scared and yeah. it's reliving whatever yeah, she went through all over again. She's a soldier. There's like a flag with a two headed snake on it. So, who did it snipe? Like, 
Yeah. With red rice boy? What does that mean? It's the flag of the Shining Light Liberation Army. Frenchie? You're dating a terrorist. Hmm. Uh. Is this true? She just wants to go back and get her brother out of there. Uh. Her name's Kamiko. Yeah, he's gonna have to deal with this for a while. Yeah, I love the fact that he's driving a Hummer. Isn't that fucking bad for the environment? I got the compound V. Proof that Vought's injected babies right across the country and something even more fucking diabolical. Worse than dosing babies. And that's just saying with these cunts, there ain't no one but you. I can give you everything you want on this list. Except. Oh. Except. Homelander. Yeah. I mean, the dude's too powerful. That may be true, but... Yeah, it's like, how do you arrest a guy like that? First of all, and lots of people are guilty, but it doesn't matter. Yeah. It's what you can prove. Yeah. Well, he just proved everything. This is full fucking crust. I'm sorry. Hmm. Well, she said she's sorry. Yeah. I still think she's, you know... That's a start, though. It's a start. Person. Yeah, that's a start though for to least say she was sorry. Yeah. I don't know you. And I don't want to. A Tran said that you have some information. He said you were looking for a uh, French guy and a black guy. Mm, just giving them all up. Skinny white guy, British guy. Oh, you think you recognize him? Hey powers from the start. Why? No, no, I'm just, uh, curious. Oh, no. It just, to well, me... wrong, because he likes her. He she likes her, but I feel like he just kissed her to manipulate her. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. The way I see... Oh, no, he doesn't he see did, her no more. Yeah, I think the way I see it is he did it so he could just move on. Okay, you know? okay. I mean, that's how I see it. Yeah, but once she finds out, she's going to be pissed. Yeah. Seven, ain't ya? Guilty. Wow, well, perfectly honest. Translucent's always been my favorite. What's he up to? I think he's on a mission. Oh, yeah, I think I read that actually. He's been gone a long time now, hasn't he? I do hope he's alright. <laughs> he's. <laughs> he just he's throwing. He's throwing all that. Uh, yeah, it's like I'm gonna tell her oh, everything. Really, you like? Let me guess. She's a good person. Yeah. Okay, I think she can help us. Help us. What do you think she's going to do when she finds out you murdered Translucent? Now he's like blackmailing him yeah, yeah, to, yeah, to, 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 yeah. to stay away from her. Yeah. Yeah. It's like every episode is directed by someone else? Yeah. Oh, no, okay. Um, I'm loving this show. I love this show. And yeah. Uh, so what do you think about it? Oh, it was Tara Reid. Tara Reid, Billy Zane? Yeah. Okay, okay. The, she was at, at the Comic Con thing. Yeah. Okay, okay. It I, was Terry, I, I thought it was her, but yeah, like, it was Terry, I don't I was know, like, but she. Yeah, yeah it, was Terry. it looked like her, but I thought maybe she's begin. you know what? She's so broke, she would do a small cameo like this. <laughs> like, I like Terry. No, I do too. I mean, you know, again, I wish she had more work, but again. Yeah, I was. Also, it was good to see Billy Zane, though. Yeah. I hope they have more, like, you know. Yeah, I think they just have a small part in this, but they're playing, obviously playing themselves. Uh, yeah. So, obviously, um, uh, Homelander knows about the boys, knows that, okay, I know who they are now, so now we could probably just say this would be I felt like this episode, to me, it was kind of slow, um, uh, but now we know for sure the, that chick, uh, like the manager, what is her name? How far? That, yeah. that chick right there. Yeah. Okay. She's like all up Homelander's nuts, yeah. literally. Yeah, she knows how to manipulate him. And that chick, I'm so, I don't know their names, I'm, so, I'm bad with names, but yeah. the Asian lady who didn't speak English. Oh, they said her name was like Kate. Sorry, sorry. Oh, K Kimiko? Kimiko or something like that, yeah. Um, she was a child soldier. Yeah. And maybe she'll be on their side now since they, you know. Yeah. Um, so the butcher she... knows that she was like innocent, like she didn't have a choice. Yeah, but he's, see, he just has a, but the thing is, only Homelander did that thing raped uh, his wife. 
My thing is, why does he hate every superhero? You know? I mean, yes, they're all assholes, but he has no proof, you know? Unless he did back shirts and said, oh, you know what? Well, okay. his hate for Homelander, it, it's beyond, it's for all of them. Yeah. Which is like, I just, yeah. to me that's like so like, he, that, he has the mind of someone who doesn't understand. Yeah. Like someone who's just like pissed off at the whole world. Yeah. It's but that's like, not how you know, the world works. He, he kind of has this, I know this verse, and it's trying to, it kind of reminds me of like saying, oh, one black person is not wrong to me, so I hate every single black person. Yeah, I, I, like. I, you know, it's like, he is one race because one person did it wrong to him, which, you know, but in this case, in this scenario, he's not wrong. Everyone who has superpowers is kind of an asshole. No. Except for Starlight. Starlight doesn't seem like an yeah, asshole. But, and, it, um, um, but so far, Queen May, okay. Mm, I don't think she's an asshole. I just feel like she's stuck. Yeah. Uh, maybe she doesn't have a choice. So she's like used to the business, you know. So she's like, yeah, she just she don't know how she don't know how to get out of the business, basically. Yeah, that's how I feel like about her, and I can see her slowly turning, but I still don't like her. You know, she still seems like she's like. Uh, if they're gonna take on Homelander, they need everyone that they can. She's, and maybe Queen Maeve can help yeah. bring him down, you know? Because so far, they he has no weakness. He has no weakness. Except so for maybe... Uh, the weakness is his, his past. So chick, they had to, uh, they had the to figure girl. that out. The blonde girl is like, I think his only weakness, you know? Like, she can manipulate him. But he has no kryptonite or anything, so that's why the government doesn't no, want to... No, they need like, to get... What they need is, since they all... This, there has to be a solution for the compound B. Yeah, that's a good so, you know, like, the way to get rid of it. Maybe you know? they need to find out yeah. who has it and then yeah. just inject everyone with we it. We don't know nothing about that. We also don't know, like, okay, that's what makes the government is, like, a scare to go after Homelander because he can kill them all. You know, there's no handcuffs, no, no gel that can hold him, you know? So I think Butcher's demand is a little, like, outrageous, you know? Mm-hmm. It's like saying, let's arrest God. It's like, you can't really arrest him. You know, so it's like, yeah. And kind of, I, I know I keep saying this, but I love the actor who plays Homelander because the way he can go from, like, being very happy and going that twisted, sinister, like, oh, I hate these people, you know? Mm-hmm. He's acting within acting, as in Homelander, so I get good props to him. Yeah, yeah. I I just feel, um, I don't know. I feel like this episode was okay, but... Um, yeah, it's more like a. We're gonna watch the next one like right now. Yeah. Remember, we're going back to back. We yeah. just want to finish the season. Yeah. And, and this episode was more like information based. It wasn't really action. You didn't see yeah. any blood or gore mm-hmm. or anything like that. So. Yeah. Okay, so let's just uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Yeah, we'll Instagram is down there. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Hey.